What's up guys, Matthew Matt Spells, today we've got part 3 of the big 64 bay tournament. We got Rock Leon versus Storm Aquario up first, then Flame Bixis and Cyber Aquario, Galaxy Cancer and Earth Eagle, Leon and Herusius, uh, Vulcan Herusius, Galaxy Pegasus and Storm Eagle, or Aquila, Flame Capricorn versus Thorm Thermal Lacerda, Midnight Scorpio versus Rock Orso, and Hades Kerbex versus Ifrid Pirate. Oh, Ow, Leon's aggression hurt him, but Aquario cannot stay in the stadium. And Aquario gets a really weak hit off. knocks it out so Aquario is gonna knock out Leon apologies for not speaking as much there as I had to redo that battle like five times because I couldn't launch Aqu Aquario keeps self scaling I don't count those so Aquario is gonna knock out Leon next we got Flame Bixis 230 WD and Cyber Aquario um, 100 no it's 85 85 aura okay Bixis Aquario Nixus is being aggressive enough to stay out of the middle and out of the range of Cyber Aquario. And now Aquario is slowing down. And Bixus is going to take this one. So Bixus moves on. Next we got Earth Eagle, 145 WD. Galaxy Cancer, D125, full plot. And Cancer lost in sliding shoe. I'll, I'll redo that. I'll give it another opportunity. We're looking for fun battles. Oh, -ho, and it knocked out Eagle right away. I'll say, I'll, I'll let it, you know, at least try to keep the sliding shoot launch. It's not fun to have a, uh, a battle where the bay, you know, loses it right away and, you know, can't hit. I'm trying to avoid that if I can. Eagle is going to get upset right away. Yikes. Now we've got Perusius. Oh, whoa, 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 wait, I didn't show you guys the face. Vulcan Perusius 145D versus Leon 105, I think, flat. Oh, and Perusius is gonna stay in the stadium. Oh, and Leon's gonna scrape, but with Perusius, you never know. Perusius is prone to those last second KOs. Getting knocked out with all that recoil that Vulcan has. Leon is slowing down though and not hitting it. That is not good for Leon. Looks like Carusius is going to survive this. They are not hitting each other, damn. <laughs> wow, I did not expect them to be in a position where they're slowly circling at the very end for so long without hitting each other. Carusius is going to move on and face Galaxy Cancer, who might just have. A not too difficult way to get into the round three, whatever round three is. I'm not good at math. Storm Aquila, 145HF, and Galaxy Pegasus, wing 105R squared up. Oh, wow, yikes. It hit it again after it got sat there in the in the stadium. That was, that was disrespectful right there. Thermal Lacerda, Wing Attack, 130, whole plot. And the GOAT, Flame Capricorn, 160, Metal Spike. Lacerda hurts. <laughs> okay, there we go. Got a couple hits off. I'll hold that. <laughs> I do hope there is no light bending. Oh, I think I see it. No, is that just the light that's out? No, there was light bending, because I just saw the flash on the camera. All the lights came back. Goodness, I hate light bending. But I have to record it in the daytime this time. <laughs> Lacerda is slowly circling. It is a bay that's got some good stamina. It's lower than Flame Capricorn. It could destabilize here at the end. Some light hits. Ooh, Lacerda's getting weak here. I don't think it's going to be able to knock out the goat. 
and it's not. Flame Capricorn moves on. Next, we've got Midnight Scorpio, 125 JB, and Rock Orso D125B. So. Oh, the theming here was use all of these special bays, uh, rain the boosters, stuff like that, and Scorpio pulls off the upset, knocking out Orso. And then finally to end this, we've got Helicrobex, BD145, DS, and Eford Pirate, T125, GCF. I believe these are better with them. Okay, Kerbex. Eford. Yikes, he just went out right away. So Kerbex, boost disc in this mode, it's more fun, is going to move on and face Scorpio. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for the last part of round one.